guys, so today I'm going to try something a little different. I'm going to be using the Smashbox Art Love Color um, Palette. And this palette here is full of all kinds of eyeshadows and um, blushes and um, soft lights, which are kind of highlights and things like that. So this is what I'm going to be using today, and they have um, little cards in this palette to show you kind of ideas of what you can do. So I'm going to be trying this out today. I'm going to be doing the indigo and gray um, idea that they give you, and we'll see how this looks. I may change it up a little bit, I don't know, as I go, but I kind of wanted to follow this and just see how it turns out um, so we're gonna do this and see how that ends up looking so first they say to apply cosmic all over the lid from lash line to brow bone so I'm gonna grab just like a little fluffy um, blending brush and go in ahead and do that and on here it has um, all of the words of what it is over the top on the plastic so one of you lift it up but Cosmic is this shade right here. Then they say to take cement and apply it onto the lid and smudge into the lower lash line. So I'm just gonna take a flat lid brush and cement is the shade right above the one we just used and it is this gray shade here. take a pencil brush and smudge that down that same color onto my bottom lash line. to blend harbor into the crease and outer corner of the eye slightly winging it out smudge into the outer corner of the lower lash line so harbor is this dark shade right here at the top so I'm going to take a crease brush and add just a little bit of that into my crease area I just want to add this very lightly. These shades are very pigmented. Um, this is the first. I've had this palette for a while. I've just never used it. foundation first so I can go in and clean this up with a wipe um, just because I knew there would be a lot of fallout and I don't want to make it look like I have a black eye <laughs> Then 
Then I'm going to go in with a blending brush and just kind of blend this in. I don't want it to be really harsh lines or anything like that. take another pencil brush and take that darker shade and smudge it down onto the bottom lash line here on the outer edge. And I probably should have done the bottom lash line after I applied my foundation and everything, but we'll make it work. I might have to do some reapplying. Okay, and then they say to pat Cosmic onto the corner of the eyes. And Cosmic is the lightest shade that we used in the beginning again. Now I'm going to go in with some makeup remover and clean up the areas around my eyes. You could also use a piece of tape to help get that sharp line, but you can do this as well. Just take anything and help create that sharp line going out after you're done. It'll also help you give you something to follow whenever you're doing your liner. Okay, and I'm going to take my blending brush and go in with cement and blend that in here in the crease and upper crease area a little bit. Then I'm going to take a little bit more of a pointed crease brush and go directly into my crease with that darkest shade again and just define that out very, very lightly. Because I feel like it's kind of got hidden in where my crease kind of falls whenever my eye shuts. Okay, and then I'm also going to go in with um, that cause cement and reapply it to my lid. Sorry about the dog. He's just going to be left. And we are finished with the eyeshadow, so I'm going to go ahead and finish up my face, and then I'll be back. Okay, guys, so I have finished um, the rest of my foundation. So now, back to the eyes. Um... We are going to go in and do some liner on the bottom and top lash line. So for the bottom, I'm going to keep it um, more of a nude color because I want my eyes to stay very open. Um, they are extremely smoky, so I don't want to add something black and make them look even more closed off. So I'm going to go in with the Rimmel London um, in the shade in the nude and apply this to the bottom lash line. Now if you wanted to go for a more smoky look, you could definitely apply a back liner in that waterline and that would be fine as well. But since it's, I'm just going out for the day, I'm going to make them look a little bit more awake and not so dark. Then I'm going in and I'm going to do a wing liner on the top lash line and I'm going to be using my Made You Look Night Owl eyeliner. This is my favorite eyeliner and she's actually another YouTuber, um, but I'm going to be using this eyeliner that she created to do the top line.
curl our top lashes. Then we're going to go in with some eyelash primer and apply this first. We're going to let that dry and apply our L'Oreal Telescopic Mascara to the bottom lash line. Then we're going to go in and do one more curl on the top lash line. And then we're going to go in with our mascara. Then for our lipstick today, we're going to go in with a nude shade and this is going to be um, Peach Blossom by MAC. And this is the finished look. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this makeup tutorial. And please don't forget to check back every Tuesday and Thursday. Please don't forget to hit that like button if you enjoyed this video. If you would like to see more tutorials like this, please subscribe so that way you'll get a notification. And I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.